it is Seb from Sam's Backyard Fishing. I'm here at Paul's house, my broski. And today I'm going to be showing you how to tie the Rapala with a Rapala knot. One of the most basic knots around for beginners. So here we go. First, you're going to want to get the line, put it straight through the eyelet. Get it about three to five inches up. You're just going to spin, 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 spin. That's six times. I'm going to put this top line, not the anchor line, you're going to want to put the top line that you just wrapped around through this little hole, little loop that will form at the bottom once you spin it. Go ahead and get that in there, okay. And after you do that, the loop is going to form at the top. After you do that, right about there, where my fingers are, push that back there. And you're going to want to get it right through that top loop. Once you get to that top loop, it should look something like this, and then wet that, and then put your thumb through here so you're safe from hooking yourself, and then you just pull it tight. And that is what the finished product should look like. Right about there, just a few loops, you can see that clearly. You cut off your excess line. And there you go. Well, tell me if you enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe if you're into fishing and you're cool. If you're not into that stuff, you're weird. There you go. Here is my Instagram account name. Sam underscore the underscore Aquaman. Follow me if you want more fishing and up-to-the-date fishing. Well, more than what I put on my YouTube channel because I cannot upload everything that I do. It's a lot of fish, big fish. It's a really fun channel. And, yeah, go follow me for more fishing tips and tricks and videos. That's the Rapala Knot. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you later. I'm Sam. Goodbye.